G'day Cats fans, just here in the change rooms uh, after our performance against Port Adelaide. Um, we're just going to follow the misfits out. Um, we're going to try and have a chat to them and a few of the other boys in the change rooms. Come with me. Got the gig. Hey, any, any chance to be involved here, misfits? <laughs> have a look at them. Zero organisation here. Lucky they're a bit different on the um, football field. Big smiles, boys. All right, hang on. You're a good looking group, aren't you? There you go, boys. Elle Henderson, sneaking forward. How did it feel? Good. Nice celebration. I'm not going to give you much. Yeah, that's here. OK, that's fine. But I was trying not to celebrate, and then Paddy got me. I tried not to. I tried to give the old Andrew Mackey, where he just runs straight back to the defensive 50, gives no one anything. And then Paddy, uh, Paddy got me. And what happened? Half time, massage bed, there's something. Yeah, I hope that's on camera. Jed reckons he saw it, and he was pissing himself. The massage bed just sort of broke in half and I fell straight to the ground. Scotty's trying to have a chat and all you hear is in the background. Pretty funny. Yeah. Good job, mate. Great game. Thanks, mate. You too. Just here with uh, Reggie Tui. Just gone past uh, Ty Canelli for the second all-time yeah. games played for uh, for an Irish player. Uh, unreal effort. Yeah. I got pointed out to him by my sister last week when I was about four games off and within the space of seven days I've kind of caught him. So he's um, he's got the premiership but hopefully I can level that one this year too. Yeah, hopefully, mate. We're um, things are going okay at the moment. How'd you find tonight? Yeah, solid. They're um, a quality side, but I thought for back-to-back -back weeks we played pretty close to how we want to play, and um, you were not bad off the short turnarounds. So yeah, absolutely doing all right. And uh, Hub Life treating you all right? Very good, mate. Yeah, very good. I'm actually really enjoying it. Um, fortunately, my partner and kids didn't get up just yet. Um, hopefully, they'll be up in a few weeks. But outside of that, I've loved it. It's been uh, it's been a really quality experience. Little shout out to Beck at home. Unreal holding up the fort. Good Good job, Beck. Yeah. Hey boys, how you going? <laughs> job, mate. H. Taylor, unbelievable performance tonight, mate. You'd be pretty happy with the uh, the back six, seven or eight or so at the moment? Yeah, did a good job, the boys. Um, we're very lucky to uh, have a midfield group, which you're a part of, that's putting a lot of pressure on the ball. So um, when you're a defender, that's all you ask for, and it's making our job a lot easier. Yeah, and a bit of homework on Charlie tonight. You sort of thought you did a super job on him. What were you thinking going in? Yeah, thanks, mate. No, I just, um, you know, all the players I play on, to sit down during the week and have a bit of a look at their strengths and, um, you know, things that I might be able to do against them and um, yeah fortunately tonight some of that work but as I said earlier when you have great pressure on the ball it makes your job as a defender much easier. Yeah unreal mate and uh, the hair what the kids think the strong feedback and that's why it's gone back to <laughs> back to the original or what are we thinking there? Uh, not so much the kids more so the cook she yeah. wasn't um, she wasn't overly wrapped uh, with the blonde setup so um, recommended we do the darker colour like and it. uh, it's actually not too bad I look about you know, three or four years younger, oh, which is nice. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Thanks, mate. Thanks for the chat. Righto, Cats fans. That's a wrap tonight. Uh, thanks for joining in. Thanks for uh, tuning in. And um, go Cats. Hopefully we'll get another win on the board next week.